everybody, Splint here. Welcome to Splint Reacts. If you are a returning subscriber, then welcome back to the channel. Okay guys, so today we are watching All Quiet on the Western Front. Now, I know that this movie has won some Oscars. I don't know how many, I don't know for what categories, and I know that it is um, focused on World War I. So that's all I know. I don't know who's in it um, at all. I don't know I think it was released in 2022, so it's not like an older movie. So I'm expecting the quality um, of the movie to be pretty good. I don't actually, I don't even know who directed it. Um, I don't read the synopsis for any of the movies that I watch. So yeah, um, if you're new to my channel as well, I don't consider myself somebody who gets like overly emotional uh, on occasion. You might catch me crying, but like I'm not, I'm not somebody who blubbers on my sleeve or anything like that. So yeah, it's just, just important that I disclose that because sometimes people think that I'm just like really like vacant emotionally, but it's just it's just not my personality. I, although I have, I have been crying at a lot of reactions recently or um, you know, getting teary. I can get, I'll, I'll get teary. I just won't be, I just won't be a complete mess a lot of the time. But anyways, I'm gonna stop talking. Let's get into this movie, you guys. Let's hope I don't cry. This is beautiful. Oh. A little less beautiful. It is so loud in my headphones, you guys, so I'm really sorry if it sounds like I'm yelling. Ah, oh, damn. It's shot beautifully though. Makes you super grateful for what you have, I suppose, when you watch these these kinds of movies. It has to be signed by his parents. Well, someone. Come on, pass it here. That won't work. They'll find out. How will they? Well, is his father a pen pal of theirs? <laughs> Not being left behind here. Over. <laughs> Excuse me. It already belongs to someone. Oh, yeah. Happens all the time. Yeah. It's yours. Thank you. Oh, Lordy. This hurts my heart. Snatching away all the legs from us now. Yeah. 
<laughs> My concern is that you don't shoot us. <laughs> Just being like, so, like wanting to fight for your country, but having like no idea what you're walking into or what you're like, because it's the first world war, right? And these kids are so young. Welcome to the 78th Reserve Infantry Regiment. We are now on the Western Front. Yes! 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 I have orders to hand over the company to the front by 6 p.m. That you may, but on foot. You must give us the trucks, though, Lieutenant. With all due respect, I have Take orders. Take the orders you've been given and stick them up your ass. Franz Muller, correct? Yes. The Supreme Army Command expects you to survive for at least six weeks of being here. Would you like that in six weeks to still be alive? Yeah, boy, then walk quicker and stop dragging your feet like you would do at home. Yeah. You understand? Carry on. We're not at a tea party here. Hey, straight ahead. Come on, put it on. Are you deaf? No, sir. I was just trying to put my mask on. Attention! Gas mask off! <sighs> Not you. You keep yours on till guard duty tonight. It's amazing how quickly their, um... It's amazing how quickly their attitudes changed. Like, as soon as they... As soon as the truck pulled up. And there was just that moment where he took a couple of breaths. And, you know, I just think that was really well done. Somehow this isn't how I imagined it. Just shut up, Ludwig. My hands, I can't feel my hands anymore. Be strong, mate, be strong. Did you hear that? Hear what? That sound, listen. There's nothing there. It is so dark, it is so dark on screen, guys. What did what? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm hit. I'm hit. I've been hit. Get off. It's his helmet, right? What is it? The others over there, they shot at me. They saw the flash of your muzzle. Huh? Shoot, change cover. Shoot, change cover. Understand? Yeah. Mm. Mm. So they changed their position. Oh my god. <laughs> That's what my mother said. <laughs> Every couple of minutes, the artillery barrage makes an advance forward. And directly after that, the infantry moves forward. That's how they come. Be ready. They're just kids. Oh god. There were four of them at the beginning, right? Because I'm assuming that not all of our main... Not all of our main guys got out of that. 
Are you all right? Is everything all right, Paul? Paul, come on. Oh, come on. Get up, will you? Help over here! See you later, Paul. We'll see you later, Paul. Oh, heavy heart. Just another morning to this guy. Okay, so this is Paul. Are you injured? No. Then start gathering. Man, 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 man. Is he just no he's just following his orders he'll take the glasses as well So it looks like he might have been the only one out of his school friends. September the 14th, 1898. Blumenthal. Sorry, did that say 18 months later? Yeah, it did. Once more, over 40,000 killed in the last few weeks alone. That should convince the general staff. The General Field Marshal. Thank you. He would have seen so much shit in that 18 months. Don't let them catch you, cat. <laughs> Never. Oh, okay, so... Our other guy is still there as well, okay. Explain to me how this is worth dying for in your mind. When you're starving, you'll do anything. Oh, I'm nervous. What are we doing? Are we trying to steal? What? Food? Just food? they're gonna steal like actual like food like bread or some sort of livestock but I didn't say it because I could hear the chickens and stuff in the background or something that's just right you see? then you are here the door or the others will <laughs> I don't I didn't really see what 
animal it was, so. Yeah, yeah good. It's <laughs> good ball. Good cut. Life is short. Where's the mill would you need him? The mill. And you know they're not going to waste a single bit of that bird and they're probably going to drink that bucket like it's, yeah, like it's soup. <laughs> hey, salut! Venez ici! Un baguette! Take me with you. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I go over. I just loved watching him, you know, comb his hair and put his hat on. What is he doing? Be doing except there's no peace so it doesn't matter no but if there was imagine we'd be surrounded by women again yeah that's true i wouldn't put trousers on for eight days <laughs> have you ever done any peat digging try sometime be worse than digging trenches in champagne it takes a lot longer than digging trenches in champagne though and you can't get away with not doing it imagine that me, becoming a military policeman, a cognac here, a pint there. A military policeman is everyone's good friend. Everyone. Got himself a little pet beetle. Letters from home. This is shot so well. Darling one, you asked us for a package of food to be sent. Four portions of sausage are on their way with lard. Eggs and a glass of plum mm. jam in there. Don't eat too quickly as I don't want to have to send more right away. I'd keep it away from your comrades if I were you. This Sunday I'll visit the grave of our boy. I'll make sure to read to him as you remember he loved that. By next year we'll be able to celebrate his 10th birthday together. Horrible. <laughs> What's her name? <laughs> she had skin as white as milk. Breasts. I bet she has a bath twice a day. <laughs> Jordan, give, it, give it back to me. <laughs> the 
these scenes with the coffins always hurt my heart That is a moustache. That theme that they've chosen is a bit interesting. Don't Jeez. go soft now, man. How many are we looking for? 60 young recruits. Oh. <laughs> 60 young recruits. His, when his breathing, his heavy breathing like that really heightens my um, anxiety. He's anxious, I'm anxious. Has he spotted them? Bonjour, madame. Just we crop. Two verb. Two verb veneer avec moi. Flipping idiots. Uh -huh. Stupid big boys. They took their masks off too soon. Oh. I actually feel like I've seen that actor somewhere, but I wouldn't be able to guess where he's from. He looks like he was in one of the, um, Captain America movies. Of selling out our fatherland. My orders are war. And all the while that is the case, I shall fight for every meter. In a few months, the incoming class of recruits will be here. The French are trying everything they can to force their completely unacceptable terms on us. We must strike without delay, with all our might. General. Oh.
really anxious right now. I'll come back for you. I stand before you in the hope that you will take our presence here today as an opportunity. I'm here asking you for an agreement to an immediate ceasefire for the entire duration of our negotiating time in order to spare our nation's unnecessary depletion. Vigan, que veulent ces messieurs? Je sais pas. Marshal Foch asks what brings you gentlemen to him. Dites à ces messieurs que je n'ai pas de proposition à leur faire. I have no proposal of this kind to make. What does he mean by that? Monsieur le Maréchal, si vous permettez. On aimerait connaître les conditions. Je n'ai pas de conditions à vous donner. Vous demandez la... He wants you to ask for it, yes. formally. Monsieur le Maréchal. I'm asking you for an armistice. Vous avez 72 mm. heures pour accepter nos conditions. You have 72 hours to accept our conditions. They are non-negotiable. 72 hours. The war will continue until you sign them. Monsieur le Marchand. It's 8 November at this point, isn't it? Understood. I don't like this theme. It's making me stress. I mean, the whole movie's been pretty stressful, but oh my god, I'll be so upset if he, go if he goes. Which is highly likely because it's a war movie. Soldiers will march, sir. Soldiers march. March, soldiers. These movies can be so hard to watch. Oh, okay, that's old mate with the eye. Can you just put it in your pocket and do that later? Come on, come on. Get out. Get out! Oh, 
Oh, that would be fucking terrifying. Shit, did he get hit? Did he get hit? Did he get shot in the leg or something? He was kind of dragging himself, but I can't tell. No, 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 don't shoot! Don't shoot! No, 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 please, please, no, 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 wait, wait, don't shoot! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! No, no. <sighs> Come on! Come on! Gotta keep moving. Unreal. Even if we end up losing definitively after all, we won't be worse off than we are with this surrender. Except for a few hundred thousand extra deaths. Alsace Lorraine, occupation of the Rhineland, mm. cannons, locomotives. All that's left separating us from an armistice is false pride, as I see it. Thanks to you and your commanders, we're here dealing with the mess that has been left by them. I'm happy for you to depart here. It's down to you. We are remaining here. On their way home, the men will die of hunger, instead of dying with honor on the battlefield. My son was killed in the war. He doesn't feel any honor. We have 72 hours left here, gentlemen, and during every minute we waste by talking about it, there dies another soldier. Let us gain mercy where we can, but, for God's sake, let's make peace. Yeah. 
very, um... It's a really good juxtaposition for how they've set those scenes that are happening on this train, which is obviously looks very luxurious and beautiful and, you know, having all the this beautiful food in front of them and they're eating like they haven't got a care in the world and then f flashing to the battlefields. Oh god, oh god, oh! Oh lordy. Shut up! <sighs> oh my god, this scene is Shut up. so brutal. <sighs> I'm, s I'm struggling to watch this scene in particular. <laughs> oh, I can't. I can't. Désolé. Je suis désolé. Je suis désolé. I want his name. God.
When were you born, Brixdorf? 1877, in June. A summer child. My family lived in Holstein, and he has a factory there. Producing what? Riding saddles, General. Why the wine and why the sip and then the... Is that a thing? A man is alone when born. He lives alone. And on his deathbeds alone. Come in. Von Heldorf, how can I help you? Hindenburg. Open it immediately. He urges us to sign. It's over! We're going home! Ah! We're going home! Jordan, Jordan. What happened? Where have you been hit? Over the knee. You're going home soon, Jordan. You think so? Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm not getting my hopes up for anyone. You must show braveness. You're alive, remember? For that, you have to be grateful. For us. For those who didn't make That's it. That's enough. Look here. You mustn't say that. Not you. Mm. Ay, ay, ay. Um, where is the, the other bloke that was sitting on the log with him? Come on, listen. You have been given a second company's provisions. Okay. We are that second company! So just it out! Give it to us! Cat? Cat? Just asking about you. Thank goodness. Jordan was hit. He's lying inside the church. You get a double portion from us. Yes. Another one. In here. God damn it. I thought you were dead. At ah. some point we'll all die. I hope he's not dead by the time they get back to him. Jordan. Yes. Thank goodness. Yes. Soup here for you. I brought cutlery. Yes, we brought cutlery as well. Mm. He's bleeding out. God, I'm... God.
I honestly did not expect that. These past two years of grenades can't be shed like an item of clothing. Paul. The stench will remain on us forever. Enough. Ludwig is dead. France is dead. What does that have to do with us? <laughs> they don't suffer anymore. Peace for them. We didn't ask for it. The others didn't ask for it, but nonetheless it happened. And nonetheless, half the world is involved, mind mm -hmm. you. God looks down. God has murderers. Oi. Ils sont du jour. Je suis désolé, mais ça ne se croit pas. That's just another great juxtaposition because they're eating all this stale food, and he's up. He's upset that his croissants aren't baked fresh. The new government will do everything it can to fulfill the duties imposed on it population through no fault of its own faces hunger and anarchy is setting in je refuse to compromise any compromise monsieur le marechal please um, be fair to your opponent or else this peace will be hated Just Let the minutes record. The armistice here signed shall take effect in six hours from now, at the eleventh hour, on the eleventh day of the eleventh month. It's so still. That must be going deaf. They've signed, Paul. You know, when once we're back home, then we will. Yeah? We must do something together. The two of us together. I'm a shoemaker, Paul. I repair shoes. Huh? You know how to read, write. You finished school. Hasn't done me any good, though. You're trying to insult me. I can't read my wife's letters even now. You're going to university, Paul. Or I'll shoot you right here. That's why he had him read the letter. Soon we'll be home, then we can eat whatever we want. Whatever we want. Was that established? I'm not sure if I heard that earlier. But that's why he had him read, read the letter. Oh, please don't try and do this again.
Regarde. C'est très bon. Come on, get it in there. <laughs> there you go. Oh. We can have an omelette. No, we'll eat them now. I'm still nervous. I'd really like them to keep running. Please keep moving. Where are you going? What happened? We should leave. Who fired the shot? A little ship. This have to happen now. When we get home, you're going to make a new pair of boots for me. This man needs care. Where is the medic? He's dead. I know what I'm doing. Impossible. I was... I was just talking to him. <sighs> he simply had bad luck. Right before the end.
why is it back to the heavy theme? Soon you will be going home to your parents, wives, and children. The war is over. After years of sacrifice and suffering, You want to be welcome to soldiers and heroes on your return? Or as weaklings and cowards who tuck their tails in when it really fine. counted? We're going back. We're going home. We will seize the planes before 11 a.m. and end this war with a merciless strike and make them see. We were victorious. Onward with God on our side. I don't have any words. He's just absolutely destroyed. As you would be. So I'm so drained at this point. <laughs> it's very interesting how different that one on one, like hand to hand, went that time around. Yeah, you know, like compared to his first kill hand to hand. I'm so angry. Fucking dickhead. Fuck. 
He looks even younger than Paul. Oh, I'm so tired after this movie. My heart hurts. That was, that was a lot, but it was a very, very, very good movie. I think that it was beautifully shot. I didn't think it was gonna get me. I did not, like, I did not think it was gonna make me cry, but I cannot be the only person who cried during that scene of him after he stabbed the the other the other soldier. That was brutal. It was a perfect a perfectly normal human reaction. That hit hard. That was tr absolutely tragic, but it was beautiful in the way that it was shot. Credit to these actors as well, I don't know any of them. I really thought that he might make it home. I think that the other thing that was really well done about this movie was how they aged him. Because he wasn't, he, were, he went in in the third year of the First World War and spent a proper, like, you know, about two years and he was so young and fresh faced when he went in and two years later he looked so old and I know that 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 there's like photos of soldiers who you know like before and after war and they look like they've aged 10 to 20 years so I thought that was really well done um and I thought like that I thought that was demonstrated really really well I really did enjoy this movie. I really did. Um, I think that, I think, I still think it's probably gonna be a little bit before I do another war movie because I, they, they are so emotionally taxing that I can't just like do them one after the other. So I was a bit surprised that this one won the poll ahead of Hacksaw Ridge and 1917. Um, but I, like, it was excellent. So, you know, I understand kind of now, but yeah. If you've reached this point in the reaction, thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for future movie reactions that will be dropping along the way. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace!